Hi viewers, please check out my YouTube channel. There is lots and lots of Maya video tutorials for beginners, intermediate and advanced tutorial. So please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos and learn professional tools and techniques that followed in Maya. Hi, Prabhu here. Welcome to modeling a complex shape in Maya. So in this video tutorial, you learned about how to model a badminton cork in Maya with perfect edge loop and mesh flow techniques that followed in Maya. Okay, let's get started. So first of all, go to create panel, polygon primitives, disable the interactive creation that means when I click on poly cylinder it will automatically created in the center of grid now go to edge mode and select the double click on bottom edge to select the edge loop so go to edit mesh and choose bevel so now you want to adjust this offset little bit so like this so and give segments of 3 or 4 or 5 so 5 segments I adjust the offset value go to vertex mode so select the bottom vertex and press r in keyboard and scale little bit in middle so press w to move upside little bit so that's it next you want to uh, make in top part so go to vertex and select the center vertex hold control and press f11 in keyboard so it will switch the vertex to face so go to edit mesh and choose duplicate face so you want to move on z so move the arrow on z so you want to deselect on clicking outside so go to object mode you want to only select the uh, top face so go to face mode and press r in keyboard so you want to scale little bit thinner so like this and go to uh, edit mesh and choose extrude so we want to extrude in Z like this. So press R in keyboard and scale in middle like this. So like a cone. So I want to move a little bit upside. So delete the top face and go to object mode. So select this one, isolate this selection. So and you also delete the bottom faces go to object mode so i want to insert edge loop exactly in middle so go to edit mesh sorry edit mesh and go to insert edge loop so you want to add in middle so press r in keyboard and scale little bit uh, in middle little bit less so like this go to edit mesh and choose bevel so you want to increase the segment to uh, 5 and increase the offset amount so like this so see here the gap will be so high i undo that one so i want to move this uh, vertex in little bit in bottom side press r and scale in middle so you want to uh, make middle uh, so you want to insert edge loop exactly in middle so go to edit mesh and choose uh, bevel so increase the segment to 5 or something and increase the offset value so like this like this so see here the uh, some of the faces are hidden so it's very easy to clear so go to object mode right click and assign new material and choose Lambert so the uh, whole faces should be cleared so now you want to uh, deselect this isolate mode so now press W and you want to move little bit in downside so like this so now I double click on this edge to select the edge loop up to N so I want to convert this edge as a curve so we have one option go to modify and choose convert and uh, choose poly edge to curve option box and choose uh, best gas and 3 cubic and choose convert so see here i move this one 
so that means the edge will be convert as a uh, curve so you want to repeat the step for all other uh, edges so go to edge mode so double click on this so uh, press G so G to repeat the last step so modify convert poly edge to curve option box you want to do same thing so I will repeat the step for all other edges double click on this edge press G to repeat the last option so do for all edges So that's it. I will convert uh, all the edges uh, curve. So here also you want to do double click on this edge and do the same thing. Press G. So double click on this edge. Press G. So same thing here. Double click on this edge. Press G. So you want to do here also G. So double click on this edge and press G. So and go to edge, double click on this edge, press G. So now I want to select the mesh and press delete in keyboard. So that means you have only the uh, curves. So see here uh, it will not uh, render in out output. See here I will press render button. So see here the curves will not shown in output. So you want to make uh, render so you want to make curve as a mesh so using uh, go to surfaces sorry curves so create knob circle so you want to create here so select this curve shift to select the single uh, curve and go to edit uh, surfaces menu go to surface and choose extrude option box and choose tube at path component and profile name sorry profile normal and choose complete polygon and choose control points and choose extrude so that means this curve will be travel on this path so do same thing on this all sides so select this one so don't bother about the size afterwards we scale this uh, curve to uh, adjust that shape so select this curve, uh, shift to select this curve, press G, so to repeat the last uh, extrude option. So do same thing for all other things. So you want to do like this. So don't do for multiple shapes, so you want to do each and every thing. So select this one, shift select this one, go to surface and choose extrude. See here we have a lot of problems or face here. So press G. So you want to do same thing for all other things. You first select the curve, shift select this one, press G. To do for all other uh, paths, same thing. So you want to do uh, so bottom side also select this one shift select this curve and press G select this one shift select this curve sorry shift select this curve and press G so do same thing for all other curves so select this one 
so and shift to select so sometimes you cannot able to select the curves in small areas so that means go to uh, so see here this is a uh, selected option so i want to disable the uh, surface objects so that means you can able to select only the curve so press g so select this one and select here sorry select here and press g so select this one and select here and press g so select this one and shift select here shift select here and press g select this one and shift select here and press g so now i want to scale this uh, objects so it's very easy so we have the uh, extrude history of this curve so i select this curve press r in keyboard and scale middle so that means you able to scale like this so i will uh, disable the shading wireframe on shader so now you got that exact shape of uh, uh, cork so see here uh, in sometimes in top part you have hole so it's very easily to clear so go to edge mode double click on this edge go to uh, polygon tab and edit mesh and choose extrude press r in keyboard uh, so press r in keyboard and scale little bit like this so hold control plus f9 so that means the edge will be convert as a vertex and shift right click and choose merge vertices so like this you want to make for all other uh, mesh so that's it so this is the way to create a badminton cork in maya so uh, we use some curves and extrude methods to achieve this shape so thank you for watching guys i see you later on some other maya videos so please subscribe to my youtube channel and learn uh, maya tools and techniques and thank you